So this particular technique is the elbow hyperextension taping. So we have an athlete here who has injured his elbow. So in order to, well, so what's happening is, is that it hurts to either fully extend or hyperextend his elbow. So what we're gonna do is we're going to bring him into just a slightly flexed position and tape it securely there so that way he can't go into a hyperextended position. So we've got our supplies here. The first thing that we're gonna do is take some pre-wrap and apply it to mid forearm and just wrap it up around the elbow and up to his upper arm. Then what we do is we need to apply a couple of anchors. So in order to do this uh, particular taping securely, we actually wanna secure it directly onto the skin, but because he needs to flex his bicep and his forearm to participate, we're gonna do those anchors with elastic tape so that way it's not too terribly tight. So we wanna make sure that when we do this that we don't do it too, too tight, but we wanna make sure that it's good and secure directly onto the skin. So now we're gonna apply some white tape anchors because the um, elastic tape um, sticks better to this, but we don't wanna encircle all the way around on the, the um, arm or the upper arm, just because again, he needs to be able to contract. So in order to do that, what we do is we just place the anchors. We don't go all the way around. We have him contract his forearm. So that way it's at its largest point that it's ever going to be, just to make sure that it doesn't create or cut off any particular cir any circulation. We're gonna do the same thing up here, have him contract his bicep, make sure it's at its largest point. And we're gonna do the same thing wrapping around. Okay. All right. Once we're good and secure here, what we're gonna do is we're actually going to apply some elasticon that is gonna create some X patterns directly over his um, kind of uh, popliteal space, which is our, um, uh, for, uh, for the elbow. So we're gonna cross our elasticon and we're going to cut this and secure this to each anchor. And do the same thing coming down. What this is gonna do is this is gonna create a nice base from anchor to anchor for us to create our kind of tape secure pieces. So we call these X's. So what we want to do is we want to take our tape, secure it to one anchor, then I'm going to do a couple of spins of the tape, which is going to create some strength in that particular tape. And I'm going to secure that fully down, making sure that he stays in a flex position. And I'm going to repeat that on the opposite side. So I'm going to spin that around and making sure that he stays in a nice, good flex position. Now, ideally I would do this multiple times just to make sure that it's good and secure. Making sure that we're staying a little bit flexed and staying nice and tight. Now, because this tape is wrapped, it's very sticky, and that would irritate the skin, which is one of the reasons that we applied this um, uh, elasticon directly right over the top of it. So that way, when it rubs on his elbow, it doesn't irritate the skin and doesn't create too many you know, significant issues. So now that it's completely secured, we will, what we wanna do is we wanna make sure that um, these ends don't kind of um, you know, come off. So we wanna make sure that we secure these down again, making sure again that we're not securing all the way around or not taping all the way around. Now once our ends are secure, these might flip around, these might create all kinds of issues. So one of the things that we can do is we can apply elastic tape completely to encircle all the way around the entire elbow 
make sure that it's comfortable, it's functional, and nobody's gonna kind of grab onto those edges or create some issues. In order to keep that edge down, I'll we'll put a couple of pieces of tape just to secure that. We want to check for circulation, make sure that he can feel his fingers, make sure he can grip, make sure he doesn't have too much restricted blood flow, and they just want to test it to make sure that it actually is preventing him from hyperextending. And he's all set.